All right, guys, so what's up? So I just came back from a ride and uh, something happened while I was uh, riding on my snowmobile. I'll show you what happened. Yeah, so I got the check engine light that's uh, clicking five times. So I checked that out on the internet and that means that it's my EGT sensor. Let me show you where that is. Oh God. This right here is the EGT sensor. Uh, so I guess I'll have to be changing that. So yeah, just uh, I don't know if it has any uh, thing to do with my uh, power valves here, the exhaust valves, because I just got them cleaned and I cleaned them good. And then uh, while I was riding in the deep snow, uh, the snowmobile like kind of died on me. And uh, as soon as I let the throttle off, then uh, it came back. It was okay, but it wouldn't let me give it the full power again. To it would when it sometimes it stopped and sometimes it came back as when it stopped everything was a-okay and when it came back well it started to, to stutter all right so what's up again guys sorry my camera just uh, decided to die it's so cold right here so I guess uh, the battery uh, took a beating so anyways yeah getting back to my uh, EGT sensor which uh, means exhaust gas temperature well, uh, it gave me a code. Changing the sensor itself, it's not cheap. Uh, over here in Canada, just that sensor brand new is close to $200. So yeah, it's a pretty expensive part. So I'll try putting another uh, EGT sensor in the snow, uh, snow machine. And we'll see uh, what happens. Hopefully it was only that little thing that uh, gave me those codes. And uh, I heard that if you want the code to go away you have to roll the snowmobile for about five minutes above 4000 rpm and the code should vanish hopefully it won't reappear so when you guys have uh, check engine lights uh, that start flashing on your dash especially a uh, meal that has an iq model maybe the the pros uh, have the same thing uh, as as the iqs have i believe they do but anyways you have to count how many times it flashes. Every flash will give you a code. So uh, like for me, the five flashes meant that it was the EGT sensor. And I believe if it flashes six times, that would be the detonation sensor. So anyways, always count what happens, uh, how many, always count how many times it blinks. So yeah, and then you just go on the internet, Google it, and uh, it should uh, answer your question. So uh, I'll be making another video and hopefully uh, that will be taking care of the problem because $200 for a sensor is incredibly expensive. If you guys have uh, any other uh, places that have sensors that are not that expensive, well, please uh, tell it to me below in the comments and uh, I'll, I will buy another sensor if the, this happens again, but hopefully I don't want to pay it brand new. I could have bought a used one on eBay, but maybe it could have happened the same thing uh, same thing again so uh, better i think that you better start with a brand new uh, brand new egt sensor or brand new sensors i always start with brand new because they they're actually the, the the brains of your snowmobile so anyways keep posted i'll be making more videos if you like my videos give me a thumbs up please subscribe i like to make videos like you guys know and especially snowmobile videos right now is an incredible time for us in Quebec, Canada. We have more snow than we could ever imagine. And it's only uh, January and man, the snow outside is killer. So uh, see you guys later and uh, don't forget to subscribe. Bye bye. I'm a